In honor of St. Patrick's Day today, people and pets celebrated in Columbus. It's a part of the St. Patty's Paldy Parade, an event hosted by Zachary's. The parade helped raise money for the Columbus and Lowndes, or Columbus Lowndes County Humane Society. Rather, a group of motorcyclists and none other than Mother Goose herself led the group from Hitching Lot Farmers Market all the way to Zachary's. Dozens of dogs and puppies and even a small pony were all among the paraders. Well, events like the St. Patty's Potty Parade really benefit animal shelters, and it's something that really helps the Columbus Lounge Humane Society. Oh, it is the biggest mix up that you have ever seen. I mean, Dozens of people and their pets attended the St. Patty's Potty at Zachary's early Sunday afternoon. The event included five different area bands, Huck's catering, and a pet parade. Zachary's owner Doug Pelham says he's been throwing St. Patrick's Day celebrations for over 10 years now, but this is the second time the event has raised money for the local Humane Society. I'm a big dog lover myself and uh, wanted to help out any way we could. All the money raised goes directly to the Humane Society. It's going to help with all kind of needed items. Humane Humane Society Director Karen Johnwick says last year's party raised over $9,000 and they hope to raise even more this year. We are really low on food and pet supplies um, as well as just all the animals that are coming in. We're doing more for them now with heartworm treatment and such and all that of course adds up really quickly. A lot of people think maybe they've got this new fancy building on the other side of town and they don't need help anymore and they need a ton of money and a ton of help with everything that's going on. And event organizers say it's not just the animals that are benefiting from the day's events. It's been an exhausting three weeks for the whole community and I'm glad we have perfect weather for this and, and it really gets the community together, gets all different parts together and after something so bad it's going to be a beautiful day. So we, we needed something, a spark to just, you know, make things a, a nice event to go out and have a good time today. Event organizers say they hope to see the event grow even bigger next year.